Hey everybody, it's me again, Kale. Here once more playing Tales of Vesperia. Last time we left off, we were in the the hunt for the thing. I think that's it up there. Let's go fight the thing. Oh man. Alright, alright. I forgot its name. <laughs> Uh, yep. Just gonna casually stroll. Man, I was just getting warmed up. Let's continue on our path. I know it began with an R. That's alright. I'll throw a magic lens as soon as I get there and I'll clear that right up. Oh, is it one of those things from the opening? He looks pretty big, though. Hello, friend. Are you as big as you look on... Aww. This is Ribgaro! Ribgaro! Hello, Ribgaro. Sorry if I hurt you. I'm sorry, Ribgaro. You seem pleasant, but I gotta take your horn. It's for the good of the people. Oh. Got it. Gained two levels in between bosses. Send him for a spin. These doesn't seem nearly as destructive as the, uh, as that wolf thing. This isn't over yet. We must meet with the magistrate. That was surprisingly easy. Never mind. I'm a little let down now. Come on, let's take it back with us. It's covered in scars and bruises. I feel kind of sorry for it. I reckon it's been attacked by desperate townspeople quite a few times. Probs. It's not the people in town's fault. No, I understand. Yuri? The horn is what's so valuable, right? This will be enough to satisfy that money grubbing magistrate. Wow. It's not like you to show pity Aww. to a monster. Is it still breathing? While you guys are busy Aww. talking, the monster's getting up. Oh, it's okay, buddy. We just wanted your horn. I'm sorry. I know it's probably going to be really inconvenient what? for a while. Why did it run away? Okay. It understood what we were thinking. The monster did? Yay. Seriously? Hey, we got the horn. Who cares either way? Go be free, Ribgaro. He seems like a nice monster. Well, we did our good deed for the day. Hopefully that counts for something. Let's be on our way. Back to town. Ah! Alright, fine, we'll fight you. I'm not against a little extra combat. Gotta keep my levels up and all that. Ow. 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 Dueling mages! Mage duel. The best kind of duel. Wait! You can't go out again after that girl went through the trouble of healing your wounds. Look, dude, it's too late. I got the horn. Where are you off to with that dangerous weapon? 
That's no business of yours. I can't have you sticking your nose into my affairs just because you're curious. This is... Sorry for stealing your thunder back at the inn. Maybe this will make it up to you. Thank, Thank you, you so much. much. But now I can't get an audience. But hold on! You're just giving it to I mean, them? I know why you're doing it. It's a small price to pay if it saves their child's life. You were planning on doing this from the beginning, weren't you? Of course he was. He's the good guy. Nope. It just came to me. I mean, or maybe not. Either way. You do realize that you just gave away our gift for the Magistrate, right? Now what do we do? No worries. We'll just find some other way to get into the Magistrate's place. Shall we see how Flynn's doing then? Yeah. Maybe he's even gotten into Rago's palace already and set things straight. Yeah, that sure would be nice. Let's go pay a visit to the inn. I don't have much confidence, but you know. If anyone can pull it off from the inside out, it's... Yeah, it's him. Lawful good palate and asshole. You're looking chipper as always, Flynn. How's it hanging? I've got a lot on my mind, Yuri. Not that you'd know what that's like. Thanks. <laughs> Managed to go out and get your bounty raised even higher? Wow. I thought you went to the Magistrate's place. I went. Along with a search warrant from the Blastia Research Lab. Ah, so you were able to go inside and look around. No. The Magistrate refused us entry. Why? He even tried to provoke us. If you really think I have Blastia, try to bust your way in, he said. Oh, that sounds like an invitation. He knows we don't have the jurisdiction to do that. He's just making a mockery of us. Well, isn't he right? What did you say? Yuri? Whose side are you on? It's not a matter of whose side I'm on. If you think you're right, you should force your way inside. No, it's a trap. Rago wants the Imperial Guard to make a mistake so he can use it as an excuse to increase the authority of the Council. If we go in now, he'll hide the evidence and feign innocence. Is Magistrate Rago on the Council as well? Hmm. Yes. The Imperial Knights in the Council are both essential organizations that support the Empire. This certainly sounds like a job for... Batman. But Rago seems to have forgotten this fact. So in short, we're not dealing with your everyday magistrate here. Well, have you got a plan for what you're doing next? <sighs> what, you're out of ideas? If there were some sort of disturbance inside the palace, the Imperial Knights would be able to move in under the pretense of emergency prerogative. Uh, oh, is that yes. all? The Imperial Knights may employ emergency prerogative to intervene in emergency situations regardless of jurisdiction. Of course. So if a thief snuck in and caused a ruckus, that'd be enough? Yuri, I know you want to help, but... But I shouldn't do anything reckless, right? <laughs> I've just received a tip that a fugitive with a warrant out for his arrest is trying to get into the Magistrate's palace. Yeah, so, uh... You know, maybe we'll stake the place out. You might catch him in the act. Anywho, I guess I'm gonna go and be a good citizen for the evening. Ugh. Let's get into position. <laughs> Yuri's a good guy. Chaotic good at its finest. I do what I believe is right, and to hell with the consequences. As nobody gets hurt and somebody walks away with a smile, eh, it's all worth it. Uh, I can synthesize some better stuff. Which might be for the best. And I'm running low on cash. Should probably save some. for you if I had the money never mind we'll move on 
Sorry to steal your thunder, sir. Time to cause a ruckus. Time to act like a fool. This place seems to get bigger every time I look at it. Are members of the council really that important? The council is a body of nobles which aids in the political administration of the empire. Which means they basically represent the empire's interests. On the surface, anyway. Huh. You don't say. So what about getting inside? Shall we see if there's a back entrance? Tough luck. Place is surrounded by a wall, and there's no getting inside unless you can clear it. Mm, good point. We're gonna need to... Uh, what? Oh, yeah, it's that asshole. Huh? Long time no see. You won't last long if you go screaming in a spot like this, your ladyship. I'm sorry, but who are you? What do you mean? Me and the kid there are old friends, right, pal? We met once. In jail. What are you looking at? I barely know this guy. Now, now, don't be like that. What about the fun times we had in jail, Mr. Yuri Lowell? Huh? I don't remember telling you my name. Oh, See? right. See? You're a celebrity, Yuri. So what's your name, mister? Huh? Ah, right. I suppose Raven will do for now. For now, huh? Who the hell does this you guy You would think he go is? by something edgy. Well, Raven, it's been lovely seeing you again. Now buzz off. Aw, oh, come on. You're trying to get into the palace, right? You just leave it up to old Raven. Shouldn't we stop him? Actually, he pulled a trick like this that helped me get out of the castle. Really? Well, then maybe we can trust him. I'd like to hope uh, so. Maybe not go with the word trust. <laughs> They're coming over here. But, but, why? Wait till I get my hands on him. No one uses me as a diversion. Screw it. Go on the direct route. There she goes again with the magic. Now what? Now we go inside. What else? We just got rid of the guards and all. True. Whoa, not the front door. Let's see if we can get in from the side. I mean, in for a penny, in for a pound, am I right? Hey, hey, so we meet again. Glad to see you're okay. Catch you later. Wait. Why does this guy have elevators in the side of his house? Uh, it's going down? Basement it is. That's eh, probably all the secrets are anyway. I don't believe this. You can't control it from down here. That seems like a design flaw. Ugh. Something smells rank. Blood. Along with something else? It smells rotten. Blood and decay. Oh no. I wonder if he's into raising monsters too. Could be. He had Ribgaro after all. Uh, uh, uh. Wait. Is he keeping the kid down here? That sick motherfucker. It sounds like someone's there. Let's go. I'm gonna enjoy putting this guy's face in the hey, dirt. you! Bring that raven creep to me right now! Huh? Why do I have to do that? You're friends with him, right? I told you I hardly know the guy. Oh, really? You met him in jail, right? That's pretty shady if you ask me. Yeah. I can't really argue with that. I think he's kind of strange, but he didn't seem bad to me. I don't think he's all that good, either. Oh, gosh! Hello, friend. You're a big boy. Let's get this over with. What? What's your name, friend? Hello, Mr. Black Rhino. That booty blastia of yours. Suck it, Rhino.
Hard to aim. Hard to aim. It's doing nothing. All right, guess we'll just fight. Ooh, a black basilisk. Is everything down here just a black whatever it is? It seems racist. Yeah, black bats. I gotta try and keep up. Oh, I'm out of power. That's like for spamming my abilities. We're done. Let me guess. Black Wolf. Hold it. Man! Not only is he keeping monsters in his basement, he's keeping only black monsters in his basement. That's just wrong. I feel, I feel, feel real bad about this. But to be fair, they are also monsters. And it sounds like there's a kid down here somewhere. And I feel that I need to take care of that first and foremost. Other door? We'll check the other door too. Just to be on the safe side. Oh, there you are, kid. Whew. Everything's going to be okay. Can you tell me what happened? A scary old man brought me here. He said it was because Papa and Mama couldn't pay their taxes. Do you think that this is the kid from before? How I'd imagine horrible. so. All of these bones. Could the monsters have done this? Papa... It's okay. Everything's okay now. What's your name? Polly. Well, Polly of the shore. Come on, Polly. Be a big boy. Let's get you out of here. No more crying. You'll see your mom and dad soon. Okay. Just be strong for a little while. We gotta... Unfortunately, our way in isn't exactly a way out, so... Might take us a while to find uh, how to get out of here, but... We're on the case. Just go away. Yeah, I beat you into What level are we right now? Nineteen. Sick. And closing in on a new level. Dang. Gotta keep punking monsters. Man, I was just getting warmed up. It's up here. This guy just got like a grid pattern basement. That's real weird, man. I'm gonna make you work. Any week two? Nothing? Okay. That's fine, Mr. Rhino. I'm getting consistently good, you know, item drops. That's, that's kind of nice. Sorry if I hurt you. 
You a new dagger. There you go, pop boy. You've already learned that, so you're good to go. All right, good pop boy. Sorry if I hurt you. I'm not. Okay. So it seems like there's one monster in every little subsection that should have a key. Or maybe it's just this one time. I don't know. I've never been here before. Well, that doesn't make me wonder. I was back this way and to the right. The monsters don't respawn. More monsters and more treasure. Sorry if I hurt you. Two of my favorite things. Alright, ladies, I'm coming. Slowly. Nice. Level 20, baby. Found a reasonable replica of Flynn's sword. Nice. Nice. I don't need all five, but I'll take them. So I did need a restock. Nope, nothing down there. Alright, later, guys. Have a good life. Don't worry, we'll probably either have you mercy killed or set loose in the wild once uh, Flynn shuts this entire operation down. And I tell you right now, this is pretty shady. Can't go in that door. So my guess is it would be this door. Damn Resident Evil keys. Ugh. Guess we can do this. in here, so I guess we'll fight this rhino and then head back. Sorry if I hurt you. We finished them off. I oh, I feel so powerful. Yay! She received the title of cleric. Now she truly is Ava.
Not just a pretty face. Her majestic presence can measure up to any knight on the battlefield. Can it though? Door open. Let's mosey. Oh well. I guess we found the way out of his uh his monster holding cells. Wunderbar. Well then. With that accomplished, I think we'll call today's episode. As we've reached what I imagine to be the halfway point of our delve into this asshole's secrets. If you enjoy yourselves, please feel free to let me know down below. Like, comment, subscribe, and we will continue our bent of vigilante justice next time. Till then, though, you all have yourselves a forever just day. And I'll see you in the next adventure. Later!